We done been around some real dangerous people, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we ain't gonna say no names, but some real dangerous people. Right. Thanks. I got here with a bottle before, bro. Niggas tight. <laughs> uh, I ain't gonna lie, I hate interviewing rappers, bro. It's hard it, because they don't, if they don't know you, they don't want to be engaging. If they do know you, they don't want to tell you too much. I compare it to John F. Kennedy. Like, he really got shot. The panic that was around him was way more severe, bro. Like, the, when the bullets went off at Trump, everybody was still cheering. Nigga take a shot in the arm, nigga take a shot in the leg, but yeah. to take a shot right by your head and to do that on purpose, niggas ain't playing all their life like that. Man, that, we down together. Come back for me. If yeah. I'm about to die by you, I need you to die by me too. No, do something, but don't come back. Don't you ain't built that. for what I'm about Keep to do. help me you running. You go. coming back go. and save go. my life. No, go, 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 Man, keep running. Welcome to the Fly Stoner Podcast. It's your boy Fly Stoner Motor kicking it with the Stoner crew. You feel me? Hello. Back up in this bitch. Episode one hundred of us. I don't even know anymore, bro. One hundred of them. You did a hundred of them things, though. That's yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's commendable, bro. Yes, sir, man. Uh, now on the road to two hundred. I wonder what 200 episodes gonna look like. I got 273, bro. Man, like Shit. and fucking subscribe, man. Yeah, straight up. 273 is I got crazy. Two, I got 273 off, off the ignit. Yeah. You gonna make it to 300? Nah, I I I, I put it down. Damn. Yeah, I put it down. But can you just bring it back up? I could if I wanted to, but it's um we audio dope pod now. I feel that. I feel that. You know Shout out to audio dope, For man. For sure, man. I ain't gonna lie, that oh. shit, man. Yeah, man. Thank you. I got something with that. Appreciate that, bro. Matter of fact, definitely. let's talk about that more, man. Um, audio dub, yeah, man. We all music, all music pod, bro. Like, I hooked up with my homie Teddy. We both went to fam, mm -hmm. and every time we connected, it was just we was the niggas at the house party talking about who rap better, you know, Kendrick or Cole, shit like that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So it was all organic, and and I just hit him one day. He was on IG. He posted some music based, and I hit him one day, and I was like, bro, when we doing the pod? He said, man, let's do it. And mm -hmm. then it just went from there, like setting up everything. Like mm -hmm. it's just been, it's been a vibe. If you watch us on camera, like you, like mm -hmm. we genuine, we genuinely cool. You Thanks. know what I'm saying? So it's easy to talk to him about music, bro. I don't, that's effortless, you know? All right. So I feel like niche podcast is like mm -hmm. the new thing. Like mm -hmm. just a well-rounded, like, all right, if you got the well-rounded thing going on, that's cool. But like that specific niche, like yeah. you feel me? Y'all doing the music, we doing um the movie, TV show sure. shit. You yeah. feel me? Like that is the new wave. All the, the uh, what is called? Gender, gender war shit. Yep. All the current events shit. Like everybody kind of like running that shit into the ground. Mm -hmm. So them niche podcasts is feel me like those gonna be the ones that go. And then imagine once you start getting like how now uh, I don't want to get too much in your bag. No, you can't go ahead. Like since y'all doing music base, mm -hmm. like y'all plan on getting like music guests? Yeah. Or do y'all mm -hmm. plan on getting like music heads? Okay. So my dog he he in the industry. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So he worked for a record label. And we're real we we intend to be well rounded in the music space. So okay. producers, editors of, you know, hip hop news, you know, podcasts, not podcasts, but platforms. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, producers, rappers, singers. We just had um Danny Canada on there. She a a, a managing editor for Bossa. Okay. You know what I'm saying? She was on the last episode. Shout out to her. So like everybody in the music space, bro, we not, you know, we not really, you know, discriminating on every, anybody. Like we want to talk to everybody that's music based. I ain't gonna lie, I hate interviewing rappers, bro. It's hard it, because they don't, if they don't know you, they don't want to be engaging. If they do know you, they don't want to tell you too much. It's yeah. like, you know, I, I do, I shout out to well, Willie and, oh, no, Willie. Um, Wallow, Gilly and Wallow do yeah, 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 like yeah, yeah. they out in the street, yeah. you know, they're interviewing people, they go into where people's comfort zone is and having a conversation with them. And I think that's important. They they actually make the show because if you watch mm -hmm. that NBA Youngboy interview, NBA Youngboy wasn't giving them shit. Straight up. Gilly had to sit there and really like 
go over, take over. Wallow had to take over. Like mm-hmm. it, it really be about that with them. I don't know what it be with rappers, yeah. bro. Like, <laughs> like mo- some of the rappers we interview, they be cool and shit like mm-hmm. that. But some of them, some of them just like they used to being in the studio and getting that personality out yeah. instead of doing that shit live and on demand. That shit just a whole. Whole nother breed. A lot of people ain't comfortable in front of the camera either. Yeah. Like they just they camera shy, they don't they not used to talking to people, they yeah. not used to articulating. So a lot of people really don't want to be with a whole bunch of bright lights and cameras yeah. on and you asking them a thousand questions about their life and shit like that. Like these niggas be still street niggas, bro. Yeah. <laughs> like that they, is that yeah. real. You know what I'm saying? Like they don't they don't want to talk about that shit. They don't want to talk about nothing at all. Street, not on no camera. Street niggas with PTSD. <laughs> <laughs> all kind of you shit drugged up. So yeah, bro. Mm. A- anytime I see a rapper rolling a big joint, I'd be like, damn. Mm-hmm. This interview about to be dead before it start. <laughs> like, you don't know. This this we about to mm-hmm. take you out, my boy. Mm-hmm. It'd be spaced out. Yeah, you feel me? Like, boy, we finna ask you ask some questions. I could be like, uh, uh. Yeah. yeah, it's over. It's over with. All right. So yeah, man, let's get in on these topics. You oh, feel sorry. me? What y'all boy, what rock y'all boy wanna t- I ain't gonna lie, this episode, we are freestyling. Mm-hmm. We just showing our talent to see. If we could, you feel me? Just do this shit off the wind. Everything off the dome. Off the dome. Off the dribble. Do do. What's good, T? <laughs> Popping. Yeah, you ain't introduced her. What do? Yeah. What's good? What's good, G Money? What's good, bro? How you feeling? I'm vibing, man. Sky blah. You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay, okay. What's you feel me? Fit check. <laughs> 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 You know what I'm saying? I'm chilling, man. Another day, dog. Now we got G Money in the building. We got T in the building. We got our producer Waymo in the building. Ooh. Yeah, man. Y'all don't know, man. It's the man behind the camera. That boy be getting a lot done for us, man. He ain't, and he don't really say much. Like he don't really be talking this shit. How he supposed to be talking this shit? It's man. nothing to say. I mean, Let's just get work done. I feel that. You know what I'm saying? I feel that. Yeah, man. I feel that. All right, all right. What topics you got for us? Um, shit. I wanted to see how y'all boys felt about this Trump situation, man. Mm. I know this this tea bag. Why he says my bag? Because <laughs> you 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 conspiracy political. All right, let, let me let me ask my conspiracy question first. I, I told right. y'all this is bag. He already got it on deck. What's not up, for, not for Trump. This is never relevant to Trump. All right, all right. Well, yeah. go ahead. What's all up? right, you see how they say the middle of Earth is hot, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> so why when you go closer to the bottom of the water, it gets colder? Says who? Okay. Because nigga, the what you mean says who? You never, nigga, you never been to the bottom of the water? You get cold when you go lower. The water gets colder. Yeah, bro, but, that's not nowhere wait, near close to the bottom. One more time. He said, "You know how the middle of the world is hot." Like, you Correct. Me? Yeah. He said, "So why when you, the lower you get in water, the colder it get?" I ain't really good at science. But look, though, you gotta think about it. <laughs> so I can't answer that. It's I don't know. Always, be I feel like we bottom, should Google bro. it. It's gonna always be the bottom of the ocean, bro. It ain't like that shit don't stop. You get what I'm saying? Right, but, but the core, the, the, the core, core of the is hot though. Yeah. yeah. But what he's saying do make sense in when you look at the aspect of going down, like you're going to the core. So if you put some, if, you, if you put yeah. water on a on a stove and it's boiling hot, like the core of it, why and the water gets hot, why doesn't that happen with the ocean? I don't know. You lost me with that one. Bro, <laughs> you got <laughs> you got nowhere got near to the you bottom of the one. ocean, bro. You was cooking before that one. You got nowhere near to the bottom of the ocean. You have no idea what the bottom of the ocean. A lot of fucking scientists don't know how the bottom of the ocean looks. Then they just had a submarine fucking crash because they tried to make it to the bottom of the ocean. Mm. And the shit was had too much pressure and the shit blew the submarine. Like, you're not going to see the bottom of the ocean, bro. That's true. Hey, so mm. maybe. Never. Hey, but look, who knows, though? What if that shit blew up because it was hot? Wait, we was talking about Trump, though. Yeah, right. nah, he had his conspiracy yeah, yeah. question. That was, that, yeah, that's how we got him. No, he here. said it wasn't about Trump. Okay. I said it wasn't about Trump. Yeah, okay. But, but, but who to say? They would never know. But like T said, if it's hot down there, it could be hot too. Like like T said, maybe that shit blew up because it was hot. Maybe, maybe. You never so. know. Mm-hmm. But scientists would never know. I feel like we need to Google it. All right, fuck then this, again, this, I'm pretty go, sure they got a little the tip of shit on the submarines with a toad. I, I ain't trying to have nobody in the comments calling me an asshole like I'm a toddler. <laughs> <than that>, so. <laughs> They're like, yo, that nigga high. What we that boy smoking? Yeah. I need three or whatever he caught. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> nah, man. This Trump situation. How y'all feel about this tr- uh, attempted assassination on Trump? <laughs> attempted assassination on Trump? Yeah. 
That's Wait, fake. It's fake? Yeah. Why do you say it's fake? Yeah, Elaborate. Oh, <laughs> right, you say it's fake too? I think so, bro. All right. St stage fake, whatever, I do whatever you want to use. First thing, I compare it to John F. Kennedy shit. Okay. Why? Mm -hmm. Like, he really got shot. And it's like, the panic that was around him was way more severe, bro. Like, the, when the bullets went off at Trump shit, everybody was still cheering. That's, they know what's going on. That's a cool point. I, I, you feel me? I agree with you when you got a, a valid point. I agree with that. If you see when, when Kennedy got shot, everybody, oh, uh oh, ducking, like a real ah! shootout. When <laughs> Trump got shot, I mean, you shooting at Trump. Bro, I, I wouldn't challenge that because when Kennedy got shot, it was more of a rifle. Rifle sound off. Yeah. They, you know, technology different now. Yeah, so yeah, I don't yeah. know. I don't know what was shot. That but you can hear like it. Baby guns. Like, it was. It's just like, you couldn't really hear that. Like it was. It was, and then pop, pop, like a almost like popcorn. Yeah. So some people were saying that they thought it wasn't even gunshots. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So that's the only. That's my only challenge to your point because when Kennedy got shot, you gonna hear a rifle, bro. Like it's it sounded off and people were ducking and screaming and stuff like that. But the pop pop, people thought it was they was louder than the gunshots. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah. that's my only point on that. Second point. If you getting shot at, you ain't stopping for your shoe. True. <laughs> True. You say you ain't stopping what? Hey, True. as a nigga who been in a couple shootouts. <laughs> Man, listen to me. You'll leave anything not, not me leading the shootout. Right. Me trying to get out of the situation. Just being I had to say part, that for the record. Part of it, <laughs> you feel right me? Right. Just being in the in the middle of crossfire. Yeah. Well, niggas is, going back getting their shoe. Well, shots is fire. Niggas is trying to get his safety, bro. Yeah, that's yeah, not, yeah. That's hey, you really say you going back for your shoe, right? Nah, I, hell no. I might. It depends. But they I done seen a couple niggas get their shoe. Yeah, honestly, not for too. me. You feel me? Like so I ain't going back to get shit. Like I'm in, and family need to be with me. Yeah. Well, I'm only I'm only returning for family. Nigga, like me, throw away you know the whole. Somebody get separated from what well, you know if we running. But I that's probably it. won't wear that outfit no more. So I say, fuck that shoe. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Yeah, come on, bro. We ain't. So you say shoes? you? No. So, so you saying you stop before your family? Yeah, no. I'm saying if uh, the only reason yeah, I would no. go back yeah. is to get like if a family member oh, got separated okay. from yeah, from yeah, us, yeah, but yeah. yeah, no shoes. Yeah, no. We buy more shoes. Yeah, nah, I get to find the niggas after. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> G, 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 that's you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all this, oh, shit, whoever, where whoever, came, whoever rode in my car, I'm, that's who I'm going yeah, back yeah, to get. Yeah, 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 I feel that, I feel that. Whoever I'm not, rode I'm in not, my car, bro. I'm not leaving nobody. I, I take that back. That. <laughs> <laughs> I take that back. I take that back. I take that back, boy. Yeah. One that. time I, I sat in the car for two minutes. We only going back for family, baby. Whoever yeah, my car. Hey, yeah, I had four okay. calls. I was like, yeah. nobody. <laughs> nobody. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I got a I got a question for later. All right. I um, I, but, I definitely got a question too, but I, yeah. I wanted to hear y'all um why you say they'll stage the uh, Donald Trump. I'm I'm agreeing with like T making good points. I'm I'm with him. Okay. Yeah, I'm with him. Every everything he done said thus far, I agree with. So, G, how you feel? You feel it stage? You feel it's real? Mm. What the fuck? He got grazed? Yeah, he got grazed. He got the gauze on his ear, bro. Yeah. You know what's so crazy, though? <laughs> My thing is, if a nigga had hit, what about to hit his ass with that 50 cow, wasn't going to be no grazing. Yeah, that, hey, that one thing, the you gun feel matters. me? The gun matters. You know what I'm saying? What but even still, yeah, like, that boy really two, try to two? hit, that boy really try to head check niggas, like, mm -hmm. on national TV. Like, Straight up. that I was about to be some crazy shit for the world to witness, for real, for real. Man, this shit get documented, bro. Like, I'm gonna look at the, all textbooks crazy, bro. <laughs> it's gonna get documented, bro. That's the thing. I can't say it's staged because a nigga ain't gonna get his ear grazed on purpose. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Bro, yeah. nigga got grazed. How you know his ear grazed right now? Nigga, hey, nigga we, got I grazy. Mean, we don't. We just see the gauze. <laughs> that boy got that grazy. He got gauze on his ear, bro. And that nigga bro, got the, like, got the, he got the, he got the clown, cherry bro. blood, man. I don't, I don't understand how he is able to just... We are literally witnessing a circus, bro. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> like, I don't lie. That's the only thing I said, like, the last time he ran, that was the funniest four years ever, bro. Like... <laughs> I was not taking nothing in politics serious, bro. Like when the nigga used to do jump shots, right? Throwing paper towels to the kids, <laughs> to the kids <laughs> and ice and shit, oh, like clown, just dog. saying all kind of shit, bro. I was like, bro, this is the funniest shit. And people I've ever really want to 
vote for him. I was just, yeah. I just, I don't, don't get it. Who else are you going to vote for? That's that's the pretty much the point. Then yeah. Biden drop out the race though. Um, it's reports of it. Yeah, Shit. not quite. It's, they they ain't really man, released that. He yeah, he he can't function, bro. Biden, right? It's over. With. It's over for him, bro. He definitely struggling. No, it's over for him. I I, I I'm I'm with you. I'm almost right. with you. And but he definitely yeah. struggling. He's struggling with some other shit. Like he can't run it. He no, I don't think he fit to run the country. He wasn't though. fit to run the last motherfucking. I was <laughs> sitting there telling niggas like, yo, y'all really finna vote for this nigga? Like I understand y'all didn't want to vote for Trump, but like, bro, y'all really finna vote for mm, this man, nigga? Biden bro? got this shit and gave away all the money. <laughs> Biden was boy, that was a. I ain't gonna lie, that was a quick four years because it felt like nothing happened. Like, yeah. nothing happened. Nothing exciting happened. We almost got tried. We almost went to war. Like, mm-hmm. Trump was just checking him. Like, yeah. That's the only thing. So, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about the stage. If his air really got shot, then I don't think a nigga go stage a bullet coming that close to his head. You feel me? I don't care how that shit look. Like, nigga take a shot in the arm, nigga take a shot in the leg. But mm-hmm. to take a shot right by your head and to do that shit on purpose, niggas ain't playing with their life like that. And it already ain't sound like a gun, so you don't even know if it was one. It's guns that sound like that, though, bro. What, silencer? Nah, it's a little twenty two, little, you feel me, small, smaller bullet guns that sound like that. They say he fired from over 100 feet. So yeah. That's what they it say. It would have had to been, it would have had to been like a, you know. A rifle they, of some was, sort. Yeah, it was a rifle. Little, people seen him on yeah. top. Yeah, they said, the, they said the dude... It's report saying the dude climbed up there, mm-hmm. climbed down, climbed back up. People saying like, yo, he's up there with a rifle. And they said, um, Secret Service dude, L1 dude who seen him, didn't want to shoot him because he's like, damn, what if that's a regular civilian? You feel mm-hmm. me? Like, that would have been his ass. Right. If he would have just shot an innocent person, like, shit like that been happening all the time. So, like, damn, I don't want to be the one to shoot an innocent person. And I get crucified for this. But why would an innocent person be out there with a fucking rifle? They don't know, bro. It could be a toy. It could be a... St- like, you feel... If you see somebody from far, it was a sniper dude mm-hmm. seeing this shit. So if he had a... You feel me? Went off and just shot dude and find out it wasn't even a real rifle. So mm-hmm. pl- so what if it was a black person? I don't see what that had to correlate with anything. Plum. What you mean? You think it would have been the same... Um, what you call it? I don't know. What, what, man, you don't know. If that was a black person. But he died too, though. They, yeah, they but killed they him. Killed, they, they killed him. Yeah, they killed him. Yeah, they killed him. After somebody else died. Him. Yeah. Somebody I'm else talking died. about that Secret Service person. If he seen that was a black oh, person you... doing that, he would have smacked his ass. Shit, I don't know. Probably. Not no probably. Bro. Probably. Right. Yeah, race got it. It's a lot. Shoot race him. got a lot to do with a lot of Understand. shit that happened in the U.S. Understand, so, my brother. I get it for sure. All right. So um, I do got a question, right? Mm-hmm. Cause I wanted to stay on the Donald Trump shit, but when we was talking about the shooting thing, you said you'll stay for your family. Mm-hmm. So did you see the clip where dude said if him and his wife are getting shot at, he's leaving his wife? Y'all seen that? Mm-mm. So it was, it was, yeah, it was a clip going around. Let me see if I can find it. Real quick. This your queen? <laughs> this is wife. That boy said it don't make sense for both of us to sit there and be like, is his wife white? I don't she know. Was it's, on a, it's, oh, a, it's a black. Yeah, yeah he wasn't. She wasn't on there. She wasn't on it. Was All right, it's a black dude though. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I think niggas that date white girls think like that. Right. He dated a white girl. I'm not. I'm not willing to die for your wife and your family. I can understand because it's dangerous. It's not fearful. It's a dangerous. Kids, yeah. Wife and wife too. Wife, no. Look, you bought her though. I'm not. I mean, like once you once you I'm get, not dying for my wife, my nigga. What are you doing in a dangerous situation? If me and my wife are running because two niggas are shooting at us and she trip, I'm gonna keep running. <laughs> you and your wife. Me and my wife. You who hurt you? Nobody. <laughs> I'm just saying I'd keep running. But you gotta be like, am I wife? Nah, buddy die? green. Yeah. Is right. it? Yeah, yeah, no, for sure. Is it? We got kids. <laughs> he, he putting all into yeah, perspective. Yeah, yeah. Put it, put that in perspective. You got kids. Do we got kids? Yeah. Where the kids at? Probably home. I'm going back for my wife, bro. What? That, I Straight thought up. that was a better reason to leave your wife. Nah, if the kids home and they with somebody or whatever, I'm going back. Like I, that's so foul for you to say you're gonna leave your wife. It's people running behind y'all, tramp. 
she could get trampled or whatever. You mean to tell me you're just gonna let that happen? What you gonna do? You gonna die together, right? I mean, we just gotta go out together, bro. What's Fuck y'all, that shit. What's your answer? This going your back. wife, though, bro. Like you going back for your wife? It's not a girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> y'all in Mexico, cartel on y'all ass. Man, I'm going we hey, they just gotta kill the both. I ain't gonna lie, bro. bro. That's a little diff. They might not kill you. Man, they finna, they mean, finna torture your ass. I don't know, babe. How you leave your woman, bro? I'm just <laughs> nah, asking. Yeah, don't don't even switch it up, cause you 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 finna make it seem like <laughs> I'm just asking feel, yeah, the question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you leave your woman? No, no, I was talking about G. Oh. He talking about the torture okay, thing. I, was, I, don't, I don't even want you to <laughs> swing it that way because you gonna make it seem like okay, nah, I don't know. Just gunshots. Gunshots. You, are yeah. you are you going back I'm for your wife? Back. Run, that's my running. answer. I'm going back. We yes. running. Bah. She told, oh, she ain't running no more. She tripped, bro. You gonna keep running. Damn. Y'all Damn. boys green. I ain't gonna lie. Nah, I ain't leave. I ain't saying <laughs> I'm leaving. Oh, I ain't agree with your ass. <laughs> green ass nigga. <laughs> Y'all yeah, asking you. No, you no, no, no. He's talking to me. He's talking to me. My fault, bro. My fault. My fault. No, I think I'm gonna think. Yeah, I think we just gotta go out, man. It's that what I'm saying. What y'all niggas talking about? That specified scenario, bro. I'm not stopping. I'm Damn. not stopping. Mm. <laughs> I'm not stopping, bro. Just paint that couch green. Bruh, <laughs> I'm not stopping. <laughs> that Y'all, specified scenario, we both getting shot at and you fall. Just paint that whole couch green. Oh, yeah. You played. No, Listen, y'all <laughs> what kind of pride and ego shit are y'all going through right now to say it's your you're going to play Rambo you and stop for I your fucking no, wife I got no gun, no nothing. Yeah, like, yeah, like what? what are you saying? We're not going to even try. That's what are much. you going to do? But what are you going to uh, try to do? What you said, it was gunshots and people are running. That's what, yeah, your, yeah. That's what your... Oh, you said people are running. And yeah, yeah. Niggas ain't even hear the question. They already... I thought you said <laughs> people shooting at you. No, it's just gunshots and people running. That, that was they the, shooting at the crowd. They shooting. Okay. Re- that's real situation. Come on. We done all been the uh Yeah, nah, we been in MLK, that's what I said. We done all been in MLK back. parade. I'll go, go back for sure. And they and they started shooting. Niggas is just running, bro. Like you can you can maneuver through people running. You on back why they still shooting? Yes. Right, this is my it's your wife though. Yeah. Not nobody else. Yes. Wife and mom. I'm going back for the old girl too. I don't give a fuck what y'all niggas talking about. I'm going back for the old girl, bro. I might not go back for the old girl. Y'all niggas wilding. You the same nigga that said you'll send old girl to prison for 10 years if because she could do it. I Last would, time I was I yeah, that yeah, yeah. Y'all niggas wilding. Oh no, hell My no. My old girl doing that shit, bro. I so listen. I, listen. <laughs> right, it hey. is selfish. Six months. It was six months. It is selfish for you to go back knowing you got kids at home, knowing that A hey, has at but, least need one parent home. So for you to play Rambo and to go back for your wife who could possibly be injured mm-hmm. or already dead and then you risking your life to go and do the same thing while your kids is at home waiting for at least one of y'all, you, that is crazy. You added other elements. You no. Said, no, I'm, I'm finna tell you the element that you added. What I All added? you said was shooting people running. Then you said, oh, she might not be alive. You don't know that. No, I'm not going to find out. <laughs> I'm, not gonna you. I'm not going to be there to that's, find that's out. That's fair, bro. Look, I'm going I'm to go back. I'm, you know what I'm saying? Especially that's, that you put it that the kids home. No, bro, I'm, I'm going to I'm the going kids. Back, bro. I'm going it back, depends man. on what kind of, you said it's a situation like it's a group, like yeah, they shooting in the crowd, right? Yeah, they shooting at the crowd. And then people just start running. If that's what I said. Nah, I right. navigate that, bro. bro. You got a chance of living, bro. You <laughs> can go was, back, bro. That's what I'm you saying. Tripping. They not <laughs> shooting at her. Like, what the you fuck? You got a chance she to just save got your in the wife. You can crawl, bro, to her, bro. Think about it. I seen the craziest shit, bro. Like, bro, when shootouts happening, Hey, niggas man. get to shooting. A nigga seen Lion King, bro. I'm gonna go back Nig- and stampede. Hey, niggas gonna, get to we shooting gonna, everywhere. We gonna be all right, man. We crawling on the floor, man. A nigga play football. I mean, a nigga play sports. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta get your agile on. No, y'all is crazy. <laughs> you'll be all right. You get you'll your be all right, bro. Like right. you'll be okay. I promise Mo, you will. Mo no, going back, man. Gotta get your army crawl on. I'm not going back. Yeah, you. Yo, girl, listen to this part. And do, and do, and if the roles were reversed and I trip. Go home to I the kids. I feel like she'll go back for you. No, go home to the kids. That's what you telling her to do. I'm telling. I'm saying. Go. I think she'll pick. Yeah, going women back for you. Yeah, but women are so. Yeah, they will go back. They'll be fucked up right now. Y'all niggas pissed. saying this in the era of provide and protect. Y'all do understand that, right? Go home to the <laughs> kids. Provide and protect the kids. I'm man, a grown ass man. man. I'm just telling you how it sounds. I'm a grown man. 
Go home to the kids where you got to provide I and protect you. for them. I'm going to go back. Bay, future Bay. <laughs> I'm going back for you. Yeah, and y'all comment below too, right? If y'all will want y'all partner to come back and save you. Cause that is crazy, especially if you got kids. These hoes want niggas to fight for them in the club. Some, of course, they want them to go back. That's in the stampede. different. Motive, you gotta go back. Bro. <laughs> you Why got, I gotta go back. What you on, working out, bro? bro? That, thank mm -hmm. you, T. Thank you. What the fuck thank working out gotta do with bullets? Thank you, T. What are y'all talking about, bro? You ain't being shot at, bro. T. Thank you, T. We said the scenario is being shot at. We not talking about being in the club. If it's fighting, one on one, like, bro, if there's no guns involved, of course you can fight. No, not you. Like, if it's somebody. If it's the... shootings. You can't do shit against a switch. May I, ask, <laughs> may, I, may, I, may, I, may I ask a personal question? What's up? How long you and your girl been again? About six, seven years. All right. You're not going back, you say? No. This, this, don't listen Listen, to me, bro. let's be specific. I say when the shooting is completely over, yes, I'm going back. Why are you going back then? <laughs> it's safe. <laughs> it's safe to go back. <laughs> it is safe to go back. Okay. Everything's over. The police done showed up. Okay, babe, where you at? What if you going back saved her? Would have saved her. We only looked at it from a negative standpoint. You said, oh, why well, I'm going back because she could already be dead. What you nigga, what if like, you going back saves her from... Like, you go back, you see her on the fo floor, like you being right there not going to make people stamp Yeah, over. Like you got a bigger Come on, bro. Frame, what? Like, I ain't, look, I'm elbowing niggas through that bit. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. What you in the gym for, bro? Like, you feel Watch me? Out. Mr. Listen, Bay is ahead. Stray bullets are still <laughs> going. Y'all y'all not mixing up the scenario. I said the bullets are still going. Y'all yeah. said y'all go back. I'm going back. She on the I'm, ground, though. So, like, I'm a you, real she's nigga. talking about, like, what the fuck? I I'm don't, I don't know if y'all know this or not, but I've seen plenty of motherfuckers get shot while I'm a being real on nigga the ground. And I'm going back. Like, they ducky covered, like, niggas shoot. They still get shot. I've seen somebody die like that, bro. I'm a real nigga. And I'm I going get up back. out of there. I'm I'm running until I'm out of crossfire. Yeah, yeah, but your girl been in the back though. <laughs> hey, babe, if you smart, get behind somebody. Oh <laughs> ah, hell, damn. Well, I mean, you know, yeah. teach his own. Dude. That's that's that's. I respect it. Y'all comment below if y'all would want y'all partner. Like, Survival hey, of the man, fittest. Drop down low. Get dropped to the floor. So, all that running. All right, so I think Russ ready to do. Oh, okay. So, all right. Uh, brief intermission. All right, man. We back from our little commercial break. And we got a new guest. What's up? I was here the whole time. <laughs> he was in the bathroom. Big damn. Surprise. Mm -hmm. I like, might have to turn your mic up a little bit. Fifth one? Turn me up. Mm -hmm. Last one. Last one. Five. Big damn. Mic check. Mic yeah, okay, check. Okay, no okay, diddy. You vibing. You vibing. No diddy. No diddy. <laughs> My fault, bro. <laughs> <Niggas Bye. pride. laughs> hey, yo. Shit. So I ain't gonna lie, man. We need your input real quick before oh, we shit. get on this next topic. Oh shit. Five hundred dollars. I you know, I, <laughs> yeah. I kinda know I kinda know his answer. If I know I him think well I enough. know him too. So a guy said if they um they're running right and they're getting shot. Well, let's say you're at a party and a a shootout happened. There's a shooting. It's a shooting. And you running experience. with your wife and your wife trip and fall. Okay. Are you stopping and running back for her? Or yeah. are you going to keep running? I'm running back. Thank you, Ralph. Thank you, Ralph. Okay. Thank you. Like Thank you, bro. Said, he said, fuck. This nigga said, fuck. He going back after. <laughs> 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 I mean, he what, what, what factors making you say you not coming back? Because I can see if you, you you probably finna try to rationalize it. You feel me? But he, he, he brought I it. I added he, other elements to it. Where are the kids? That was my first question. He said, the right. kids are Where at home. Where are the kids? And they said, the kids was at home. I was like, all right, the kids is home safe with whoever they safe with. I'm going back, bro. And I say, I'm running to go get the kids. Because <laughs> why would you risk both your both of the parents not being here anymore? Mm -hmm. you so you, you thinking about the intensity of how, the, in your mind, it's really going down. It's going down. You feel me? Right. If, if she's safe, she's safe. Like, after the shooting, I will go back. But if not, I'm not, while the shooting is still occurring, it's still bullets being fired, I'm not turning around and trying to be Rambo. I don't have a gun and shit like that and risk my ego and pride. And now our kids don't have both their parents. Yeah, I'm trained for situations like this. With no gun? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know, bro. That's pride. Told us it's been an army crawl. It, it could pride go both ways. Because <laughs> what you're saying is pride, too. How? 
Cause you that's saying you're not going back. You 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 made a vibe from this girl, family, agree, and God, agree, right, and mm-hmm. your family too. Uh huh. Well, sickness and health, you know, what I'm saying facts. You know, for better, for worse, or whatever. That's worse. <laughs> if she got a gunshot wound, I'm gonna help her heal. To- <laughs> how <laughs> you ain't even going back? So how? I, and I'm, I did this. Is what I added to ransom. I say, well, what if you going back saves her? Cause cause they were all speaking in a negative tense. <laughs> Like, oh, what if you go back and she already dead? Well, nigga, what if going back save her? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's going through the scenario. <laughs> See, I'm willing to die about this shit. That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, this your wife. That's pride, though. That's You're... not pride. It's just like I made my mind up. You yeah. Know I mean? Like, it's just. You don't think that's pride and ego? Nah. What he's standing on, bro? Ego. But you standing on ego, too. Because you like, I'm not, I'm not going back. The, the, and the, you, you <laughs> firm on that. Me putting my ego away saying, okay, I may not be able to dodge these bullets. I may not be able to, to survive this shootout. Let me make sure these kids still have something to go home to. That Man. yeah, that's putting your ego aside in a specific way. Yes. Never gonna grow up However, 18, find out about that. <laughs> and beat your ass. You did what? <laughs> you didn't even go back for mom. I'm with you. I ain't gonna lie. Hey, yeah, you tripping, yeah. man. Nah, <laughs> like, a long time ago, ass. I made up I made up in my mind, you feel me, and it sound dark, like, but I love living and like, you know, this I done had a great life, you feel me? For sure. But this shit ain't that fun to where I'm just finna negate my responsibility and my mm. responsibility. I, I agree. My family. Mm-hmm. So like But you got other responsibilities. You got more not saying you they're more important, but it's definitely a vital role of having your parents in your life, bro. You're supposed to do whatever you can to protect your queen. Okay. Whatever you can. Now, but I get where you're coming from because I it's do. Like, I do. It's the you you win the kids, and I and I get that. Mm-hmm. You feel me? So it's like ain't no wrong answer, but I'm just I gotta go back. I got to too. Now the second topic was before we um had ended it. Mm-hmm. Roles reverse. Mm-hmm. Would you want your partner to come back for you? Nah, don't even come back. Man, fuck that. We down together. Come back for me. He said, like, "Come back for me." Let me run it. Hey, let me run this shit. I like, I like me that. alone. Nah, no distractions. If I'm yeah. about to die by you, I need you to die by me too. No, do something, but don't come back. Don't come you back. ain't built Dad, for what I'm about to do. Help me, you running. You go. coming back to yeah. save go. my life? No, go, go, go. Man, Keep fucking chilling. running. We go. dying together. It's, it's gender roles, <laughs> bro. The same way I could probably count on two hands how many diapers I changed. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah. It's the same way, like when when it's your turn for your role to kick in, it's yeah. like it's your turn. You feel me? Oh, a nigga was beast with changing diapers. I ain't gonna lie to you. Nah, yeah, I was, I was, Listen. I was a beast. I Go. still am. I practice just on on my home girls or whatever that had babies. Mm-hmm. Like recently, I practice to keep my shit sharp just in case the nigga pop out with one. That's why you need to leave your partner. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nah, we we uh leave your partner and go change come the diapers. Back. Come back. But it, it's also too like preparing, like so, like let's say for instance, you 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 kind of thinking about, all right, I'm not making it. This is a real conversation about how like people just live a day to day life, and not think about worst case scenario. Because mm-hmm. also you might have insurance and all this and college funds and all that. The way they set, the way you really like, hey, bro, like I got none to do with parenting. No, nah, but you, but you, you thinking about you. Like being them. there, you yeah, know what I mean? mm-hmm. yes, which, and I get that too. Like that's the that's the that's the uh, like the part where I'm kind of on your side because it's like who gonna raise your kids better than you? Exactly. You, you need at least saying? one. You're not one wrong. Of you're not wrong, bro. You you're not me? wrong. I don't feel like I'm wrong either. I feel. Yeah. <laughs> I feel that. What y'all, yeah. what y'all say with the roles reverse? You feel me? Y'all would y'all want y'all partner to come back for y'all? Oh, I, already gave, I already gave you my answer. Don't come yeah. back. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't come back. I'm gonna be all right. He said, "I'm gonna be all right. I ain't come back." Cause y'all talking about some. You act like you said we got. All you said was your part of the trip. Yeah, so like, this is trip, nigga. Keep going, bro. Me, if I fall, I'm staying down. I ain't getting up. Cause once I get up, oh, I need. That was your sign to stay down. Once you trip, bro, just sit down until the shit over. It ain't gonna, nah, it ain't gonna last that long. Stay, you could get stumped. Though. But I think hey, everybody seeing it. Stumped. Seeing, everybody seeing that. it. They way like in my way. I'm going like I'm. I'm on some John Wick shit, and yeah. I'm about to do something. Now, if you t- and your, how you thinking about it? You thinking about like it's ten Ks and they all got 
cause nigga, everybody we got <laughs> switches. <laughs> nigga, we don't even see it that way because it's like it's it no happen. chance at all. All it takes is for one person to trip over you. It's a wrap after that. Everybody falling on you, bro. Yeah. Everybody falling on you. Agreed. Oh, that 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 fighting to stay up when that crowd doing that. He's talking about, oh yeah. yeah. No, he said, oh, ain't nobody tripping. Uh, ain't nobody stumping on me. I'm big. I said, nigga, they gonna trip over you and nah. then everybody else falling behind them. Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah that, 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 that being close to the ball, I got a little chance. I could, you I could be, um, bro. you could be an NFL running back. That shit, it go wrong for you. What's that? All it take is one. All it take is one. Hockey ass nigga. <laughs> My y'all, I done, I done, I done trip through a, through a encounter. Mm-hmm. Trip, do do do. Somersault. <laughs> yeah. Get up. You got, you got to just I, get back up, nigga. You, I, nigga, do you remember, yeah. nigga? I fucking failed. Bust my ass, pop my shoulder out of place in the middle of a shootout. Damn. Like, nigga, I know, bro. I stayed my ass on the floor. I got, See, I, I got up, ran out that bitch. I, I got, got a, I got a question, but I don't know if it, I don't want to interrupt your format, but. What's up? So, let's say you go to the club with your homeboy. Right? Mm -hmm. Y'all, you and your homeboy at the club. Y'all meet up there. And then he introduced you to his home, like his homeboy end up coming or whatever. His homeboy come over, he introduced you to him. You just met the nigga. Right. Let's say. <laughs> I already see where it's yeah, going. Yeah, yeah, Ask yeah. me, please. <laughs> Let's say he get into some static. Mm -hmm. Like near y'all. Yeah. Do you help him fight? Nope. Nah. That's how niggas die. Because you got to think. Yeah, nothing to do with I don't know. Do you not. Like, not, are, not are, we, are we partying together? Like same we, section? He come, he, you, you meet up with your dog. Y'all yeah. doubt. Boom. Yeah. And y'all go to the bar, y'all get something to drink or whatever, but y'all in y'all little corner, whatever, your normal comfortable corner. Okay. Like, let's just say you go wherever you wherever you you frequent. You okay. know what I'm saying? And his dog come over, clap up, boom. Oh yeah, hey, this yada yada yada. Oh, this my dog, cool. yada yada yada, cool. cool, cool. Five minutes later, buddy chilling on the wall, nigga just come through and he splack him. Oh, Bam. Nice. And, and and in, in our section. He got came in our section. Yes, he not, a nigga come over there and he's Yeah, like, nigga fighting. It's a one-on-one? On one? I'm going to get him up off you. No, if it's yeah. a one-on-one, on one, let, let them boy go at it. No one-on-one. On one. Get them boys on the other What's side of the road. No one-on-one. Like, <laughs> like a couple <laughs> niggas reset, come reset, over. Reset, one, one, nigga squabble. Set it off. one nigga set it off and then the rest like... It got to go down like that because if your homeboy here with him too... He's gonna end up fighting too. Yeah. If, if it's three, that means you gotta fight. Yeah. If it's three of them, that's how it end up happening. If it's three of them and it's like five of us, I'm gonna hit his ass with that bottle. <laughs> nah, but you okay. gonna help him? I'm gonna hit one on, but right you, on top of his But you gonna help? But yes. you gonna help? <laughs> you act like a nigga ain't gonna see his friend get hit with a bottle, nigga. Hey, they coming after you. Tell what you doing? What nigga, bro, one thing help. about it, bro? Yeah. I got hit with a bottle, bro. When nigga hit that bottle, nigga tighten up. Tripping. <laughs> 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 right, you you hey, tripping, bro. Every nigga want to do playing. that shit and see, like, bro. Yeah. Hold on, niggas go to hold on. Bro, nigga, yeah. nigga. <laughs> you, that shit that bottle like having a gun in the club, right. boy. <laughs> <laughs> nah, for real. Shit, <laughs> 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 nigga get cracked across the head with that bottle. Nigga go to back it up, boy. Nigga, I got hit with a bottle before, bro. Niggas tighten up. <laughs> That's why I be on the perimeter. No bullshit, they do, though, bro. They do. They do. Nigga get too interested in the fight being the middle. You know how hard Nah, yeah, bro. I was yeah, Superman you know, getting a little. Especially a Ciroc. I'm here with it, here with it, here with it. You know how thick a Ciroc yes. bottle is? Anybody Hennessy yes. bottle, bro? Bro, Ciroc bottle. The biggest Ciroc bottle. A Ciroc bottle is nigga, okay. I know, no, no, I know. No, look. Nigga, I'm not lying. Nigga. Oh, shit. Yeah. Nigga got me right. Nigga been mm. on nah, point ever see. since. <laughs> We done been around some real dangerous people, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we ain't gonna say no names, but some real dangerous people. Right. right. So imagine being like, let imagine it's them. Put that person in your mind mm -hmm. on the other side. That's and, true. And then they approaching this person. You don't know what he did to them. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. That's real. That's real. This that's gonna real. go after the club. <laughs> yeah, that's and true. And I don't know you. You feel me? The best I could do for you is getting them yeah, up get off, them you. off you. Mm -hmm. Somebody swing at me, then like I'm kind of into the scuffle, but I'm that's not true. finna be on full attack for you because. Yeah. That's real. Some dudes be doing some green ass nah, if shit. Not, I feel you that's what you're saying, Russell, because if, if you want some like decreasing the situation shit, okay, cool. But that's why if you de if you decreasing it, and, and then they try to black you. Oh, nah, <laughs> yeah. nah, it's a problem. You know yeah, what I'm saying? That's my problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you gotta, I got you. Okay, you got know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I switched my answer to that. <laughs> yeah, I agree. But think about like, y'all know who some of the type people I'm thinking about. Imagine really beefing with them. For the next five years, <laughs> type shit, because he robbed them. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Nah, <laughs> really? Hell no. Yeah. 
Now you in some shit right. for no reason. Real shit. Like mm-hmm. now your whole life done changed. You like ghosts. Now you can't get out of the game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Damn. For some bullshit. For some bullshit. Hey, I really I got have shit. nightmares about shit like yeah. that. Yeah. 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 Shit. I'm in mean, this shit forever well now. <laughs> Nigga yeah. had eyes on a swivel. Yeah. <laughs> Nah, I thought about that shit. Nigga, life changed by one night. Yeah. This shit crazy. It's and then the wrong place at the wrong time. Fighting like, bro, but, tighten up. Yeah, nah. there's women in the building. There's all kind of cool stuff going on. And, Security. Yeah. Y'all boy, when the last time situation? y'all niggas fought? When, what's the last fight you had? What uh, year? What year? My last fight. Oh shit! I just had a fight. Damn, nigga. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Yesterday. <laughs> my last fight. My last fight was. Was it this year? You like fought this year? year? It was last year, right? Like, but it's been a couple of decades since I fought. Yeah, it's it's been been like it was a little scuffle. At least, at least my basketball years. court? No. What? Shit, it was a club. It was a little club. scuffle where we're not really major, right. but you know. Not over anything you did, but just. Nah, I don't know. Last fight time I put my hands on somebody was. Back in Tally, me and Chris, when we we had jumps up. Oh, yeah. There was a big brawl going on. Yeah. And it was just like. That shit was just that's a, a multiple. What year that was? Look how many years ago that was. Yeah, that's ago that was. That's like, right, right. What year was that? You think? That was before I graduated. So I was like, oh, yeah, eight, I don't even oh, think nine. y'all boys was up there. That was yeah. like right before I y'all got up there. there. No, no, yeah, but I wasn't going. Oh, there. No, yeah, it was still going on when y'all got yeah. there. Mm. So it was around that time. But we just like, agreed, oh, like, eight, like oh, hey, nine. bro, like you too visible to keep. You feel me? Yeah. And we remember we had that big standoff where it was like Jacksonville and then the whole Miami. I'm like, bro. Somebody could get really hurt. Bro, Duval and Day that had like issues. And like 20 on 20. That, 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 he said was. That, that I'm like, nigga, that shit yeah, for them, going that down. Is, let them boys carry on the legacy. That's let me old. tell you something, bro. The first time I ever heard what Duval was was grad night 2003. We go to grad night. And Damn, we man, just oh three yeah, nigga, old, bro. Like I'm I'm 39. Bro, you're at ancient mm-hmm. nigga. So <laughs> <laughs> hey, you only get one more. <laughs> that's, your, that's a free one. <laughs> you only get one more though. <laughs> but no, nah, that's the first time. Oh, them them Duval niggas got a got an issue. Yeah. Dude, what the fuck is Duval? Where is that at? It's a Jacksonville. I know. I, at the time, <laughs> yeah. we, you know, you don't know out. where that like, shit what is. That? You know what I'm saying? Like you, don't, you ain't never, you ain't never heard the shit. But yeah. Dayton Broward. I still never. And maybe that. Palm Beach. Yeah, I still. I've been there for a little bit, but that I ain't gonna. That first time you hear that Duval war cry, that shit hit different. Oh yeah, them niggas. <laughs> that shit they, vibrate. They, they, <laughs> they city pride up there with Atlanta. Ain't nobody city shit sound like that in no, the club. Ain't. Like it ain't. ATL ho come close. Shit, you'll man. hear that. Yeah, you'll be up there. ATL, hold it. Like oh, they'll the say that. Mob shit. Absolutely, man. Duval, but ring. Duval shit. I think they got the most legendary. I, I got to give it to them. They rank number two after Samoans. <laughs> nah, I don't even say they got. <laughs> boys up I think Duval, bro, that you, shit you, sound crazy if you ain't deep enough. Two Duval <laughs> niggas, and it sound like a lot of them. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. That shit sound. I think they number one. Shit they sound like wolves. One. Yeah, they gotta be. Like <laughs> we ain't got shit. We ain't got. We got nah. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> niggas got you. That's it. But yeah. it ain't loud Pop like that. Trump. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> uh, nah, yeah. I think yo been a little. You we know? got you and yo. That's about it. Yeah, uh-uh. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. We yeah. really don't call. got shit. Though. We ain't got shit. Now that y'all like when y'all put it in that perspective, like nigga, yo. we got other cool shit though. Like what they do. Yeah, but that was yeah, Duval, but that's, real I'm war saying, cry. Like, uh, that's a war cry. Yeah, like some like, shit about to go down. Doom. Uh, like, get on point. Uh, like, man, what the you, fuck we gonna say? You hear that shit, boy? It's like you know what I'm saying? Three o five type shit. <laughs> hey, the fool's one is um, what what up though? Oh, you talking about Detroit? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, bro, what? What up though? What up though? Hey, you, hey, it, up? And it's crazy. Like, <laughs> you know, we done all been around a little bit. Like, but I'm our Dade County mindset. We just think we the hardest ever. We do. Mm-hmm. Boy, ain't it crazy when you go somewhere else and realize, hey, boy, they really like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, these, these motherfuckers <laughs> some savages. Yeah, I, awesome. I learned that in New yes. York where I was like, man, these niggas be catching the subway. They can't have guns. Yeah. Remember that so night we awesome. walked out of Webster Hall, all yeah. the Brooklyn niggas was yeah, on there? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I'm yeah. like, oh, this shit, oh, this shit dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> and you got to get on the train. You can't even right. just hop in the whip and yeah. clear. Yeah. Niggas, niggas carrying, they ready to use this bitch. <laughs> like, oh, for real, for real. Mm. Everybody got a gun down here. It's like, it's... Nigga, you just walk in the store like it's Walmart and get yeah. a gun. Yeah, like, I'm there, nigga. You more vulnerable. Yeah, you feel me? You got a gun, nigga. I'm ready. I'm I'm ready to risk it all. And I'm right. trying to find out them boys had guns. So, yeah. Even worse. Now you now I really know you crazy. You got wild. a gun in New York. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's wild. All right. I do got another topic. 
It's funny though. I should have asked this before Ransom got here. Mm-hmm. Oh shit! Because <laughs> mm-hmm. I be I be ready to get in trouble. Mm-hmm. I don't give a fuck. I'm pleading for cap. Cap. <laughs> but go ahead. I, yeah. I be waiting to do this shit. Like you got to just do that shit. Like 50 minutes in, they ain't gonna be 50 minutes in. You feel me? <laughs> 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 they gonna stop watching after 30, 40 minutes. They gonna fall asleep. Or they, some they shit. retention rate. Low. Yeah, like you feel me? The attention span low as fuck. So I was just thinking this random as fuck earlier today. Do y'all boys think y'all done hit every zodiac sign? Mm. I would never know because I don't even be asking girls that. Bro. That that's why I say like that's just like it's random, but it's like I feel like certain zodiac signs mm-hmm. attract certain zodiac signs like. You may realize you done talked to a whole bunch of uh, queries or yeah, a whole bunch of areas. I, I think that's yeah. me. You feel me? Like, yeah. So, do y'all feel like y'all done at least touched every zodiac sign? How, how many, how many zodiac signs is 12? it? I, no, not 12. 12. Like, 12. 12. like eight or nine? It's we 12. all got smartphones. Each month. Each month? Yeah. Sure. I mean, him? it's not by the month, but it's oh, like. So, it's 12? Yeah. Okay, 12. 12. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, it's like, 12. It's 12. Yeah. For Man, me. looking crazy like, nigga, what the fuck Aries, you talking about? Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius, Pisces. I don't even be knowing, bro. Uh, like, even, probably, even, even when a girl tell me what day is, I forget that shit the next day. I don't never ask. Them. Unless you they just, like, it, that's, this, is just math, this is a math problem, bro. Yes. See, yes. Yeah. But, all right, you said it's a math problem. Now, that's all it is. Do you think that you... Without even knowing, without asking, you tend to have a set person like you attract more Gemini's or Cancers. Exactly. I, w- I wouldn't even know because the the furthest I'm going is when you was when was what's your birthday? Yeah. After that, bro, I don't know what your sign is. I don't study that shit. I don't know nothing about that shit. I don't yeah, even sure. ask people that question because it's just like yeah. I want to I, I want to deal with you based on how you deal with me. See, not, no, I don't no, ask no. it either, but it's like. Over time, you start mm-hmm. realizing. Yeah, like even if I go, if, even if I be scrolling IG and I see a girl's birthday, like somebody who I used to deal with way back then, I'm like, oh, you a fucking Gemini too? Like, why the fuck is I'm, well, y'all I'm niggas just yeah. surrounded by Gemini's type shit? Like, y'all niggas over but you know that's that's crazy because, all right, you know how they say like you got a type, right? Yeah, yeah. and it's like you you really ain't got like one type, but it's probably like three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Set. yeah. Mm-hmm. But don't you notice that? <laughs> Yo, types you be having the same types as you. Like you can see her, her new dude or her ex. And yeah, like, that Damn. is true. You feel me? That's also mm-hmm. true. Mm-hmm. Bro, dress like me, bro. This, that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is also true. So that's why I'm thinking, like maybe you might be attacked, uh, attracted if the zodiac thing, like, is what they said. I don't might even be condition a... my mind to, to ask. See, so you know all right, saying? like I don't, I you don't. you don't have you ever been turned off by a girl like? You done had a conversation with them. You be like, nah, you just not my type. Like, hell yeah. That's like, that's all. Yeah. That's that's how I deal with people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just being real. You mindset. know what I'm saying? Like, it don't have nothing to do with when you was born. If we can't get along, we can't have a conversation. I'm never talking to you again. Yeah. See, but I think that goes off of it. Could you feel me? It that, could. That I'm, I'm not saying. saying you're wrong. I'm just saying I don't ask. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I, I don't agree. dive into it. I don't. I don't. But if you did the see. math, it could be something. Else. It could be you, you. Y'all boys might be right. You know what I'm saying? But like I, I don't know. Like I haven't ran across like probably like a Aquarius like that I know of that I talk to. You feel me? Or like. Motherfucking that shit probably did. That probably shit they probably ain't click go nowhere. Yeah, that, I know, get, that one trying to say. All you I know me? is everybody that got a birthday around mine, we all get along. Exactly. And I know I'm a lot of people that got a birthday near mine. All I can say is I'm the be... 14th. I know somebody seven days after me, we get along. I know yeah. somebody a day before me, we get along. I know Bro. somebody who born on the same day as me, we get along. Like everybody in my birthday yeah. era or whatever. I ain't never had no problem with them. That's what, facts. What's, what's your sign? I'm I'm Aquarius. Okay. I'm a Pisces. That's the same thing with me. Every Pisces that I ever talk to, we get along perfect. Yeah. Cool but y'all, y'all date y'all on sign. I, I date yeah, whoever the like, fuck. It's crazy. Think like, and look good. <laughs> yeah, bro. No, I, I date whoever look. Yeah, pretty. Got ass. Man, like. do you got ass? <laughs> is you pretty? And can you have a conversation? I, I don't know this. That's it. Yeah. I don't give a fuck what animal you associated with based on when you was born. I don't. bro. I notice I butt I heads. Like when like somebody say somebody is something. I'm like, dang. We friends, mm-hmm. but we got like at ours energy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Or that like, happens. Yeah. Or you say like, all right, I've generally been cool with this type of person yeah. you start to see that they fall in a certain slot yeah like, see you know, people say it ain't real but it's like bro 
Yeah, it just certain it's shit. It's ingredients like, to everything, yeah. bro. Like you born on a certain day, it's a, the weather at a certain time, it's this, the, the All I can everything say, position. That might have, it might have something to do. It may. All you I can say it is, is just your side act just like your ass, bro. Yeah, but that could be good or bad. No. Yeah, but it's like it's a good thing, bro. I'ma say no because I got a cousin. Same we I'm talking the, about you dating, bro. Well, I'm just you yeah, say, yeah. I'm, I'm saying the sign, but you say this your signs act alike, right? I'm talking yeah. as far as dating. Like whoever you talk to, if you talk to somebody your same side, like that shit gonna be a vibe. I disagree. The only thing I, don't think I, that. I disagree. You, is you, when y'all both get mad because y'all act the same. Exactly. I disagree, you know what I'm saying? I disagree because but Go ahead. Y'all know, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know what y'all getting mad about. Like, you know what's going Y'all pressure, y'all points. You know what I'm saying? But like, if y'all if y'all petty and both stubborn. And you know what not to do. That shit don't got nothing to do when you was born. Nah, I feel like that. In my opinion. That shit don't got nothing to do when we was born. boy. I know, boy, I know one that's petty just like me. Bro, women, <laughs> women is petty. Men is petty. It just depends on what you give a fuck about. Yeah. That's that's, I, the I people know. that give a fuck the most is the most pettiest. Because <laughs> you care about whatever it is that you want to get back at somebody for. You know uh, what I'm saying? Nah, it's petty situation. It's just, and that shit comes with situation. Nah, because if you don't give a fuck, you're not going to go out your way to be petty. If you don't care. Nah. nah you care, but it's situation. just like, a, I'm going to show you. Yeah. That comes, well, I guess then it's pride. Then you care. It's pride. Nah, it's pride. pride, 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 pride. Then you care. You don't nah. care. Pride is care. Not really. You give a shit about you standing 10 toes down on what you believe in. That's pride. That's care, bro. It's, I, it's synonyms. Yeah, but that's all it is. also care yeah, could be is you being a bigger person and like, you know what? It's not that serious. Let me ask you this one question. What's up? If you over the shit, why do you care about getting back at somebody? Yeah, I be over when I'm over. Nah, well, and it don't take long. Some people get, don't. Cause I gotta then you make you care. Feel. Then you care. Then, no, really? then you care. You do. I just gotta make you feel like how I feel. You give a fuck. Yeah, nah, I ain't got <laughs> that. That's what you it's do. Petty, you man. give a fuck. It's about it's about that get back a motherfucker. Man. I'm hell in that right. first a little lot slice of shit. <laughs> a lot of shit. <laughs> it don't you. even matter, bro. It, a lot of shit don't even matter. It don't. It you know don't. what I'm saying? You 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 really holding on to shit that. But you can use that energy somewhere else. Listen, I done met some stubborn people, bro. They don't give a fuck. I yeah, taking that shit to the dough, nigga. I feel you. Yeah, nigga. And then over time, <laughs> and then over time, you not, know what happened? You get older, you be like, you know what? That shit was stupid as fuck. You know what the fuck it was? That's I feel like that very fast. You know what? I'm actually not petty. I'm I'm more like, like you, this is my brother. Yeah. And if he wrong, and somebody in the corner right, I'm not gonna make it seem like he right. I'm gonna be on the side of whoever right. You right. feel me? Facts. Still loyalty, but I'm like that. Now I mean, that, that's how it's supposed to go. Bro. Nah, but I'm like. Ten, like how people be stuck in their pettiness. I'm yeah, ten yeah. toes. Some niggas don't like, give a fuck. If you right, you right. If you wrong, you wrong. I'm not defending you if you wrong. Hey, I, bro, I, bro, I just told Mo that the other day, bro. Nigga, all that. Oh, I'm with my brother. Right or wrong, shit. No, the fuck, I'm not. Nah, yeah, I, 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 I don't know. I'm you kind of cap. The wow. Cause you don't give a fuck. Like if it's if it's some outside people with us, like you feel me? Like I don't want to say race wise, but <laughs> 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 if it's some outside people, you don't give a fuck. What you mean? Fuck though? them. Whoever the outside race is, yeah, you don't give a fuck if they right or wrong. Fuck them. That's how I mean, your mentality is. You I'm, don't give a fuck. Oh, you talking about it's the outside outside race? Yeah, I'm trying to make me seem like a racist. Now I say I didn't want to get into it. <laughs> Man's you, a you making me explain it a little bit more. <laughs> Not you really, bro. Because I'd be more so if he's right, you're right, bro. Like, I, no, bro. bro. I don't. I'd have been with like, you. Can't nigga. be like if that, bro. I don't if you, give a white, fuck. black, brown, blue, bro. If you right, you're right. You know what I'm saying? Like, but yeah. the loyalty can still be too. Yeah, my like, loyalty's still there, but you right, bro. If I what don't give wrong? a fuck, I'm not. It's no petty. There's no reason to be petty, if I, in my opinion. That shit don't even work for me. It I don't matter, bro. It don't last long enough for me to be petty. You know, petty like, she ain't answering the phone. All right, cool. Now nah, you're not going to answer the phone. Cool. For Look night. how you sound. I called Duh. you two times. You called me one time. <laughs> I got one more. You called again. No, I, I ain't yeah. answer. All right, now I'm calling back. Man, let me know tell you something. I'm gonna call one time. You answer the phone and you don't. Cool. I'm I'm on to something else. Fuck that. I'm on to something else. And then when you call back, cool. We have a conversation. If you don't call yeah, back, yeah, that, that's the type of like. If I'll, you don't call I'll back, hold no grudges. Yeah, yeah, yeah if yeah, you yeah. don't call back, the next time we speak, I'm gonna let you know that you were the person that made us not talk yeah. no more. Are you, That's are, it. Are you done being a brat? <laughs> All right, cool. <laughs> I'm more, I'm more flighty than you know what I'm petty. saying. Like, like if, whatever, you, if like, you do that and you show me that's what you own, yeah, I ain't trying to strike back. That's yeah. what you own. People, I ain't trying to change your yes, mind. Bro. I ain't trying to manipulate. Straight up, nah, man. If you mad and this what you willing to do, oh, I'm mad and I ain't finna answer the phone for you five days. Well, yeah. Well, you fuck. That's shit. dumb. I'm acting like we. And I want to talk to you. I'm gonna talk to you. Yeah. yeah. I'm acting like we want to even beefing. Oh, okay. And let's not act like we only want to talk to certain people. So like, what we what we doing being petty for? Yeah. You know, I'm gonna change how I view you in my mind, and I ain't gonna tell you though. 
Because if I was like, damn, I see you like this, and you do some crazy shit like that, and I'm I like, feel what? like it's past the level. Oh, we still going to vibe when you call me back on the fifth day. <laughs> But it ain't gonna ever be the same. I'm gonna ask though, bro. It ain't I'm, gonna ever be the same. For I'm me, I'm gonna ask what you was like. What? Why did something happen? I'm gonna ask nah, that. I ain't asking nothing, I'm gonna right. ask did something happen for us to like not communicate as consistently as we did? Cause what if it be a dumb answer? Then I know how to handle you from that point forward. Because if it's a dumb answer. Because like, I feel like I was you testing know, you. Yeah, I feel like Don't you know me. me well enough to. Know what I will and will not tolerate. Like, yeah. don't play in my face. Yeah. So your answer will determine how I deal with you moving forward. If I feel like you playing in my face, it's a wrap. Like, you going to the back of the bus. Yeah, nah, yeah. Nah. You know what I'm saying? Like, we'll speak when I feel like talking to you, or if not at all. But if Damn. you give an answer and I'm like, oh, that shit makes sense. All right, cool. Let's move on. Well, you Aquarius are crazy now, Flynn. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm older to like, oh, again, I'm probably seven, eight years y'all boys senior, so. Yeah, I, nah. It's a lot of shit that I just and don't it, give a fuck it's about. It's how you start with people, because a lot of times <laughs> people get messed up or hurt by people where I'm like, well, I start everybody at zero. Respect yeah. earned. In the, I, don't go, I don't go from 100 down. I yeah. go from zero up. So all the little shit you doing, that's how it's like your Xbox achievement point. Yeah, you got to yeah, stack yeah, them yeah, things yeah. up. That's real. You know what I'm saying? Because it's yeah. like you give somebody that much level of respect and they come out, they go come out and test you and say, well, I'm going to do this and see what you mm -hmm. own. Your mindset even doing that is yeah, like, yeah. I don't even rock with that. Why would you <clears throat> test me with some shit like that? Yeah, monopoly. I, I treat you based and on how you And I don't do that to nobody. Candy, so I, you man. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't fucking play with me. <laughs> Damn, bro. My real. Bad. All right. So I got one last topic. You mm -hmm. feel me? This is more in, in Waymo bag because this is dealing with music. Mm. So I want to ask y'all. How do y'all feel about JT going solo? You feel me? She just dropped her album, mm -hmm. City Cinderella. Do y'all think it's like cool for that? You think she holding it down like how Carisha was holding her down? You feel me? Now that Carisha kind of in the situation, is JT showing the same level of respect? Because when JT had to do that two year bid, Carisha was holding it down, mm -hmm. made sure her half of the money was put up. Make sure she got a chain when she dropped. Make sure she was pretty, you feel me? Straight. Now that Carisha is kind of got to lay low, is JT holding Carisha down, vice versa? How, how y'all feel about that? I mean, shit. It ain't it's something we don't. We will never know, bro. We don't know really the, 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 the relationship between them, bro. Yeah, of course not. But so, I don't know. I just I don't think that's something we could. I, I mean, I don't I feel know like what, what they doing for real, bro. The, the just, little bit we know about them, you feel me? Like, we know... Jatavia a little bit better, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. And, you know, we know Carisha enough just to, to see how it play out. Mm -hmm. Like, we don't know them, but Jatavia is more of a musician, I feel like, and yeah. an artist. So that's going to have to weigh into it a little bit where I feel like Carisha had an opportunity to be an entertainer. Mm -hmm. She doubled down to being an entertainer. Yeah. So it's like, we both made it. We both out the hood. We both living good now. That money and everybody full, you want, really want to be a rapper. Mm -hmm. And I want to be in this world where I can sell products, I can rap when I need to, I want to do that. So I think like their motives is like different now, you feel mm -hmm. me? But I, I think that's why they okay with it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like JT trying to be a rapper rapper. Yeah. She I trying agree. to do some shit. Yeah. And I don't think that was ever uh, Carisha aim, you feel me? Mm -hmm. Like I think she just, like, yo, you, she got a bag full of tricks. She finna do all of them. She like, nah, I'm trying to be up there. I'm trying yeah. to be ranked up there. I honestly mm -hmm. feel like Carisha would never even drop a solo album. Nah, that's what I'm saying. Like, like at all. Like, I, she, I'm with... Oh, she, go ahead, my bro. Nah, I, nah, I'm just saying, she had many chances to drop a solo album. Right. When she was out by herself, she, she was holding it down, doing... Not saying the bare minimum, but she was doing what she had to do to make their name stay relevant and yeah. shit like that until JT came out. Now that JC dropped that album and she taking music super serious, like this, this is her time to really like. It's well overdue. Even I say all the time, even when JT first got out, she was supposed to go feature crazy. You feel mm -hmm. me? When she was hot, hot, like she was supposed to be Gucci Man of that era. Like, yeah. When that first day out dropped and everybody was fucking with that shit, nigga, she was supposed to keep going, keep going, doing songs with the hottest. You feel me? Climb that top, climb that top. She kind of slowed down. I guess with the relationship wise, but 
I don't but know. You know that artist shit different though, because you could not be in the mindset to do that. That's also or it could be some contract shit or a whole. But bunch that of ain't shit the time. Then you feel me? When you bubbling hot and you that artist that everybody been waiting for you to get out, you supposed to attack that market. You supposed to cash out. Like you, you could have ran up a couple M's. You could have been the hottest for a year or two, and mm-hmm. then you could have had that time to chill out. Mm-hmm. She let that time kind of wave out, and now she bringing it back up slowly but surely. She could have just had that wave. Brought it down and then brought but, it back but up. I ain't gonna lie, it's a good time now because all that like that peak peak excitement for female rappers Fact. is gone. Now it's cream cream of the crop. Yeah, now you got really rap. And now. she she part of the cream. You feel me? So yeah. it kind of work out in her favor to just like be able to come and and do that now. Like are you right? She should have did it the first time, but this second go round, like it could hit the same way. You feel me? Yeah. I think um, just back to your question about like holding each other down. Mm-hmm. I think they did a good job collectively mm-hmm. because each one of them had shit going on. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. And when they got out, they made magic together. Once they were back together, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying. They got uh, they got together enough for us to know who they are. They got hits. They was got, it really magic? I mean, was it, it really was, hits? bro. Like, just think about how they started. It was they made a they made a hit off accident. They 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 hits they, came before they went in. I'm talking about the first first ever song. They said yeah. they, was, they was playing around in the first album, like the first two albums. I think that's before Jartavia went in. This is the but well, when they when she got out, did they have a hit after that? Like a Billboard just hit? hit, hit no, hit. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but what I'm saying is they made it to the industry by accident, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like hands down, they said they went into the DJ booth or I mean, the booth or whatever and they was playing around, they made a hit and the shit went viral. Yeah. So for me, I feel like when you make something like that and you weren't really trying to, now you got to navigate how to keep it together. Yeah. And that was the struggle with them. So in my opinion, they both held each other down in different points of their life. Mm-hmm. Grisha done been pregnant, JT done went to jail. Mm-hmm. Like they, they all was like trying to figure shit out, life out. Life was happening as they were Bubbling that superstars. I think they did a good job, bro. Like, and they still friends, right? Yeah, and, and they then, they solidified. They still friends, bro. Like, if they still friends, nigga, they ran that shit up, and they both successful. Yeah. Even they if they ain't the same they, friends, they, you feel me? They they had they a little cool. altercation on Twitter. You feel me? That's the last. Yeah, the little back and forth. Where yeah, them yeah, girls yeah. do that, man. We know that. That's yeah, Caddy's yeah. type. You got to be that's, aware of them QC. You know that's that girl trips to Miami. Yeah, that's Caddy. Was she at the album listening party in New York? We don't know. I don't, yeah, I don't know. Not, not that I've heard. Of. Gotta, I didn't. I didn't hear from Carisha in a good little minute. Yeah, we don't know. You know, well, you, you know, a situation. A yeah, yeah. But life. remember, we was in Vegas when uh, when Pussy Talk came out. That was after the fact. Life and is then during that time, man. they had like a couple of. That wasn't after she got out. Pussy Talk was, I think, why the, why she was locked up in 2020. Yeah, JT thought, just got out. Like, I want to say like two, three years ago. I don't know, bro. This shit like if they know snap all this shit together, bro. Yeah, bro. Listen, like, bro, like J- JC just got out like two years ago. We since they've been out, I can't remember like a I hit. Like hit. Was, I think the song with Usher, mm-hmm. that was that's kinda, a big ass song. Yeah, that was kind of. I don't know if that's song, Usher bro. song. It is Usher song, but that was like two years ago, right? What the song the Usher, Usher, right? Yeah. yeah, that like two years ago. But it but, rang off though. It rang off yeah, for two yeah. years. Like you could still. Get in the car right now and they'll play it on the radio. Yeah. You know right. what I'm saying? So I just think I think they did a good job of holding each other down. Just to answer the question. I do. You know what I'm saying? That shit hard, bro. Like, just think about it. Yeah. You get a hundred, let's just say you get a hundred comments on a on a on a photo, you ready to fight. Like <laughs> yeah. niggas fucking around playing with you. Imagine you go to their page, bro. They got 21,000, 30,000 comments, bro. Yeah, it's 30,000 people. Telling you about yourself and they never been in the same room with you. Yeah, bro, they real, they, real, <laughs> they real solidified coming out of that era though. Like I was thinking about God the other damn, day, like, boy, you, this shit crazy. You see how like from from back when we was younger, like somebody would bring up Salt and Pepper or something like mm-hmm. that. Yeah, yeah, like twenty years from now they're gonna be bringing up what they did, nigga. When I was in New York, nigga, they playing no bars. Like, that's what I'm saying. They they solidified down like, like for real, for real. I'm it's, looking at that shit like, damn. People like, that survive in this era, I think they are a little bit tougher than the last era. Want to give them credit for? In the last era, all you did was read about how people felt about you in the newspaper, yeah, or, or magazine or some shit. It's one motherfucker that wrote some shit, yeah, 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 and that's yeah, it, yeah, yeah. nigga. You go open your phone and it's, it's fifty thousand people mm-hmm. telling you, hey, hey, hold on. <laughs> but re- you remember when we first got on Twitter? It was like. 10 people who yes. are funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not everybody funny. Everybody, yeah, yeah. everybody, everybody funny, learned bro. the formula. 
Yeah. <laughs> so Just in your comments, that. are they still a joke? It's a good 60, 70% percent like. It's a nigga with a joke they done stole two years ago waiting to use that motherfucker. Or they yeah. just got that A, B, C, A, A equals B equals mm-hmm. C. You feel me? Like, they, they got the formula, so now code. it's like, <laughs> just now it's worse. <laughs> yeah, yeah, bro, yeah. That, shit, that shit tough now. Yeah, man. So it's like, you know, it's a different era now, bro. I think they I think they did a good job. What, y- what y'all say, T, G? I said what I had to say. I, don't, I feel like they cool. They, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we, like, I won't say we, but the outsides, that that's looking in, bro. Like mm-hmm. they just going off of what they get, being reported. You get what I'm saying, bro? Mm-hmm. Like so know what really fuck going on. So if we had a a rap group, right? No, you feel me? I had I got missing. You were holding it down, but when I came back, I said I want to go solo and make my own money. And then I just end the rap group and start making running up my own bag. Do you feel like that's okay? How soon how after you, know, you got back did you go solo? Two years. I'm saying no. So we was holding you down. You went like we got hot. Mm-hmm. You get pop. We go to jail. Whatever. You come back. Soon as you come back, you going solo or you gonna wait two years? You saying wait two years? I'm all right with that. Right, but was it a shared decision? That's the thing. It's yeah. like it's a difference. I'm all right with that. That's why I said we somebody never walking know. away because we don't experience that. Like, all right, boom, we moving as a unit, mm-hmm. and somebody just walk away. Yeah, yeah, and do their own thing. Now it's like, damn, you use us as a platform. If you're not growing, bro, I don't want to be around you. Right. That's but, just me. But if we just on two different vibes now, like, hey, I'm I'm good with everything. Don't last if you forever, come to bro. the group and you say, bro, I want to go so like I want to really venture out and try my own shit. Mm-hmm. I'm respecting that. I'm respecting it. That's real. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, if you're not growing, then we ain't the right homeboys for each other. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Like, that's just that's just how I look at it. So Look, at Outkast broke up, bro. They didn't broke it, break up, though. But They, they stopped, just stopped making music. That's yeah. what I'm saying. But it's court is like, it, it, they, it was like an amicable split. You feel me? They, yeah. they, they, I don't they, think it was amicable. I think they, we just don't know what happened. Right, but it's still <laughs> big boy jit like that's Uncle. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, That's what I'm saying. Like but they was friends before rap too. Yeah, and everything ain't that's gonna important. be perfect forever. See, I think that's what people mentality mm-hmm. is like. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be. We're gonna be dogs from zero to sixty. We should be though. But nah, it depends on the relationship. I, like I, if y'all like was always wise, coming and going, yeah, not it's easy wise. to maintain that. But if you like locked in, you got more um, space to like get into some real friction that might push y'all apart. You feel it, me? It could, I think the, I think friends, real friends stand the test of time. So I'm pretty sure you got a homeboy or y'all got homeboys that y'all done been friends through every era. Mm-hmm. Y'all niggas in elementary school, middle school, high school, niggas done got married, divorced, got a girlfriend, had a baby. Like all this, and that's still your dog. You may not talk to him every day, mm-hmm. but when you see the nigga, it's like y'all never missed a beat. Yeah. Yeah. That to me, those are the real friends that see, but that's not group wise. You feel me? That's not you have to do everything. Like if we want to go on tour, I have to wait on you to say, Yeah, we're going on tour. If I yeah. want to do the show, we going as a package, like I have to wait to say, Oh yeah, I could do that, I could do that show with you. Right. So that's why I say that is two different things rather than y'all going as independent that. artists, like, okay, if I want to do a tour, I can just go get up and do a tour mm-hmm. under JT. It don't have to be City Girls. If I wanna, you feel me? If I want to do this talk show, I don't have to do a talk show as a city girl. I can do it as Young Miami. Yeah. That's the difference maker. It's all conversation. Me? Yeah. And everybody got to be able to have communication amongst each other. Even you know still, like, bro, you yeah. get into this big age, like, yeah. she got a whole family. Like, I can understand. She you can't just get up and go on yeah, tour. For sure. You got two kids. I ain't got no kids. Yep. I'm ready to grind. Yeah, let me go do my thing. Yeah, let me go. And maybe like you, like you were saying earlier, Russell, like maybe it was amicable in, in the in the spotlight yeah. of them going back and forth. That's all we remember. They could be cool as shit now. Yeah. You know what true. I'm saying? And and supporting each other. We that's still don't know if Carisha was at the album or you know, listening party yeah, yeah, or whatever. Yeah. So it's like, I think, bro, with, with girls, it's I think it's it, harder with girls because it, it'd it be a whole bunch of other emotions involved in that. I say even if she wasn't. The backlash she kind of getting right now mm-hmm. with this whole situation, she probably told her like, "I ain't gonna lie, I want to come, but it'll probably be best if I don't come." That's what I'm yeah. saying. So many other, uh, other like this, factors. Yeah, this your spotlight. You don't want to say, "Oh, Carisha finally popped out after the mm-hmm. Diddy situation," and I fuck up your whole listening party, your whole yeah. shine of your album dropping. Like, I don't want. That's why I said, bro. It's so much we don't know, bro. We don't know. They probably yeah. We we right podcast. Sure. We just we gotta speculate. 
Yeah. Somebody want to hear and our opinion. Like, like, yeah. It's, it's no, I ain't like, talking about us. I'm just saying. No, I ain't general. I'm like, talking about yeah. us. I'm saying I yeah. brought the topic up because we, to, we have to speculate. You <laughs> My bad, me? bro. I don't want no smoke. Somebody <laughs> might be your main, your, your your main correct dog. Ass. I don't know be, what. <laughs> shit, I, I know them personally. I don't know they had beef. It might be a se- everybody in your life in seasons, bro. Somebody mm-hmm. might be I'm a just main man you, this season. <laughs> and then later on, it's just <laughs> like, like, yo, we still down, but, you know, we live two different lives, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. You play football, I play baseball. Like, sure. We ain't gonna see each other all the time. That's real. You know what I'm saying? Whoever on your team now is like, you with them every day. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now it's exactly. like, oh, and we play the same sport. Exactly. So now y'all, like, but when you see them, it's like, nah, it's, it's, it's still love. Yeah. So mm-hmm. I think they just in two different spaces. Like I said in the beginning, Carisha more on entertainment. I'm in mm-hmm. Hollywood. Going crazy. She, she had, she Monroe had a road type shit where it's just like they finna JT you trying to make up. You want to sell this? You want to do that? JT trying and to rap. She is trying to show people that she's been can rap. trying to she be did. an artist yeah. even before we even knew. I respect yeah. it. Before I'm, it was a city's girl, she was trying to be an artist. I'm trying to sell out these shows she was by myself. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to drop this album by myself. I'm trying to shoot these videos by myself. Trying she to show got you it, bro. The album artist. Y'all heard the album? I didn't. I didn't listen to the whole the album. album. Hard. The album was hard. To... I heard it, top to bottom. She got some slaps on there, and then she got some shit on there that she really working with that that can make some noise. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, yeah I'll check feel that like shit it's out. a it's a ranking right now. Let's say if it's the shit done dwindle down about ten girls, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. she in that pack. Yeah, and that's the show. And we just it's really it's seen it's a pack it's of five. She in the pack. Yeah, I don't know. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's, it's talking about right now. We ain't right, talking about I, I yeah, right now. No, no, I know. Talk, yeah, I, I, I can't I, say. I, I, name, I name filed off the ripper. I can't. I can't <laughs> say. It's, it's gonna be sexy. Five. It's gonna be Lotto. Yeah, glow, glow, glow. Uh-huh. Nikki, Nikki, Nikki. You still she gotta put Nikki lane. in there. You gotta put Nikki. Nikki just dropped Pink Friday. Nah, but she's like the Godfather. You gotta put like the Godmother. Cardi, albino looking girl. No, no. Is Cardi still in in that? Yeah, she just dropped literally a I, day ago. You got she Ice, dropped. you got Koi Ray, you got the the um Flo, Flo Millie. Um, no, Flo it's Millie. another girl. Flo Man, Millie album was pretty good, but it's it's girl. The girls is making noise, bro. Like bro, you, JT you, is in the five. Y'all trying her? I can't yeah, I so like, respectfully. Nah, I can't put her in the I five. I can't put her in the five. Like, wow, I she probably number we just six. Just name four all, without even trying, bro. What? But no, no, she might be in the five. Over sexy red. No, you sexy can't, red. You can't. Bro, who said sexy red? red no, you can't. Glow. Bro, you true. That's that four. That might be the most motion without Nicki Minaj legendary status. That's five. That's, that's, like, that's bro, already put, five. We can't put Jay Z and what NBA Young Boy right now. I just said, man, we talking about right now. But Nicki's still active. Yeah, we got to. We talk. We just got three right now. Jatavia better than Glow. No, but I understand. But she's still active. She's still making music. So you got to add her in the five. Bro, listen. Huh? This nigga said G-U wildin'. These women out here is making records, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> glow they is, vibing. Glow, n- without Nobody disrespect. Nobody making more, 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 hotter music than Sexy right yeah. now. Nobody. Yeah, but she's better than Glow. Glow got hits right now. Glow got hits about? as well. And but, she doesn't? The fuck is you telling me? No, no, no. Not more than... Nah, I got, she got, got, got that blue yeah, collar. she does have more hits than her. I, I, she got that blue collar herself. work. They on the heels of each other. They on the heels of each other. They on the heels of each other. How many songs does she make by herself for you to see? That's, that's my point I'm trying to make. No, you feel me? We talk about JT got by herself. We're not talking about city girls. women lyrics of all time. She damn near one out of five already with hit singles. I ain't got a nigga no. and a nigga what? ain't got that me. Damn you you going to see that caption from now. Thank God it's Friday. You will see way yeah, more JT no bars lines. No. Too, bro. You will see way more JT lines than you going to see a glow bro, line. I, I, I love disagree. No bars. I disagree. I ain't going to lie now. They, they, they I disagree. Kinda, you got to think about outside of here like Glow be and then she and and, and Gotti do a great job. The only one that's probably better is Sexy Red and Megan Thee Stallion. I'm not saying that JT is not a major artist, but oh, it made it made the style. That's only two. That's already made the style. That's fine. You got a bump up. You got a bump up. She in the top. 15, bro. I but give you she that. Top, no, top 10. Bro. Top 10. She in the top. I'm talking about JT. No. She top 5, bro. She, no. She no, top seven. no, 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 bro. You no. being not, you being my, you no. being Miami. And I like J. I like JT. All right, look, look, look. All right, look, look, look. G shit. You being Miami biased. All right, let's be real, bro. Y'all wild. Yeah, like, so you're saying sexy red. Yes. Right. All right. Glorilla made the style. I'm not giving that Glorilla skip. You bro. crazy. Now nah, you got, well, go ahead. And niggas ain't mentioned Lotto. No, we said Lotto. Oh, yeah, did. Okay. Bro, like that scientist girl above all them hoes y'all name it. My bad. Mariah the um, scientist. Hey, <laughs> stop it. Stop it. She not even charting. I'm not gonna yeah, say yeah, that yeah. charting matters like that, but these women is charting, bro. Yeah, they no. charting. They making the music yeah. and it's happening and it's hitting. So name Glorilla hits, please. 
Like how y'all boys be vouching for? Like I just a, I just gave you a quote. You name she one. Never not had that it, shit bro. just came out. Name another one. What? what? Thank God it's Friday. She just dropped. Yeah, glow. <laughs> what? Yeah, glow. Yeah, glow. That's yeah. a hit to you, nigga. You wildin'. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, yes. <laughs> what y'all you are got, crazy. Y'all Tavi got hits then, bro. She Yo, got, TV oh, got that. that right, come on, bro. Y'all making it hard. I'm not saying that scene. You like hate it, bro. It is. Like, it's like, we're like, being it's, critical, bro. It's like it's greed. Like, we're not Michael saying said. we're not saying that JT she's not, isn't talented or don't got hit. She's better than Glow. But I can't. That's, no, see, but I that's cannot a, say that. I cannot say that. We talking about straight heat because remember, you ain't gotta be the best to be the hottest. I cannot say that. bro. There goes the interview. We not. I don't. I don't, Listen, got, I don't city, got political tasks to yeah, these people. City this, girls, this is my honest opinion. City girls yeah. is the hottest thing that come came out of Miami in the last two years. Absolutely. Absolutely. You feel since me? Trina. Yes, yeah, exactly. Has nothing been the biggest. They've been the biggest since Trina, bro. Like, we talk of numbers. But you got other women out there that's making better music. That's all it is. So what's JT hits? Man, bro. Man, no bar shit hard. What's it called, guys? No, no bars, bars is hard. Th- she got three hits, bro. Who? Oh, glow to me. What? That yeah, glow. What are you reading? I just put her top Shit, songs. Her and Cardi no, but are Jamal? you on Billboard or are you just reading? Nah, like, I'm just going off. No, Billboard. don't do that. Billboard chart history. Yeah, there you go. Go to the chart history. I bet John Tavy on there way more than Glow. I I, I, I disagree. All right, watch. Well, Solo disagree. or as a group? I bet it. I got a hot dub in my pocket. Yeah, Glow. Uh, fuck nigga free. Oh yeah, she got about five. Thank God it's Friday. Mm-hmm. That's three. Them top what? Top forty? Top ten? Them? them no, 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 10? no. I'm lying. She got one top ten hit. Okay, and, and how many? How that's many? That's what top... Cardi B. Yeah, yeah. Tomorrow, that was a bang. Okay, I just said it's up tomorrow. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then JT. Okay. Solo, J- I don't think JT on there, she, bro. But you can't say it's solo. Awesome. Come on, songs do she have solo? So they that's what. We, but that's the conversation. You can't push for something somebody ain't produced, bro. You produce it for something that's so then why make. bring her up? Because I say she went out. Of, I say she because she on there with you, all Carisha. But you no, ain't gonna that's, take... that's City Girls. We not we not comparing them. That's Green. That's not, bro. That's yeah, this yeah. the conversation. <laughs> bro, it's like it's like how can you how can you try to try, uh, Jotavia? What's how much singles do she have? She just got solo. So how the fuck is she gonna be on the Billboard? So why did we bring her up? Is my question. But that's like a ring. She can't argument. be in the top. Then she can't a ring by herself. It's like all right. Yeah, bro. Like, like you can't be in if you if you you can't say she's top five and then make key, a case for why she Jotavia, can't be in the top five. Hey. Jotavia's up there, bro. Because she's on there. Go the Billboard still. Go. City girls they only got a top ten here. There you go. The end of the discussion. End of the discussion. How is they win is 26 will act up. Now, because y'all boys be talking off of passion. Damn. <laughs> and I get it. I'm from the crib too, but I understand. <laughs> but I can be objective about it as well. They got music that we like and love. No, I don't like it. I just. No, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just being real. They, we, they got music that we love. But, and we go hear it all the time when we go out. But, but do it translate in into like a hit by the metric standards? It does not. Yeah. Yeah. And and we we kind of gauging off like that intangible heat. That, yeah. That, that, that the city girls have. Like city girls is iconic. For sure. So we we that's why we didn't even Especially think about the Especially influence wise. You feel right, me? Yeah, like, right, in front right, of the crib. Right. Oh man, they major. They major. Not we even front of the crib. Like as Women a whole. Period. Yeah. Absolutely. They they brought but the ratchet are they, out. But are they iconic without a, a Absolutely. top 10? Without, no, hands without down. Yeah, without yeah. a top 10, yeah. Hands down. For shit show. Hands down. For shit show. Impact uh, impact alone. For shit show. Okay. Everybody say period. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like that, yeah, okay. That, we don't even need to go any further yeah, after that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Everybody says yeah, that, that was Every Gucci. Woman says that was period. Gucci before the, the lemonade era and all that. Yeah. Before he had a number one. It's like Every woman nah, says period, bro. He helped make this type of music. He ain't got no number one, but like he helped like I, I, I know you and I know you sure. you a, a bigger TI fan than me, but it's like when somebody say T I made trap music, I'm like, nah, bro. Yeah. So How we you... registered with them certain types of beats, mm-hmm. that was Gucci Man and Jeezy. You got Gucci, but Gucci wear out then. Nah, boy, yeah. T.I. came out before. But T.I. content was more trap, but I'm saying when when trap music came through, mm-hmm. niggas was copying mm-hmm. them two niggas beats. They were using, they producers. Yeah. yeah. They wasn't doing rubber band man type beats. Yeah. No, but the them content. Producers, they, they was half a million dollar producers at yeah. the time. That's what I'm saying. Pharrell, but it, 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 it yeah. is what it is. You That's had to have a check. You had, to, you had, to, be, yeah. you had to be signed to a major to get the budget to, to cut records like that. Yeah. So that's why niggas was going to Zay. You know and, what I'm saying? Lex, niggas was using and, Lex Luger. Yeah. You know, niggas was lo- using And that, that helps shape them. the sound. Sometimes it's going to sure. be like that. You working with what you got. And then Drummer like, boy. And them, drummer them boy, boy got the drum, but jammers too. Like, does that mean T.I. didn't help create trap music? Yeah. Content I, think he wise. Was, I just think he was the godfather. Yeah. And then after that, I, there are a ton of rappers we could put 
over that, like, re-engineer the sound. You know what I'm saying? You got the Gucci's, you got the, you know, Migos, you got the Futures, you got everybody else that came. Jeezy, what about what about Mr. Know? What about Mr. Biggs? Well, Before all these niggas. No, nah, hell no. <laughs> That's a cool song, though. Yeah, I feel you. No, know, it's, cool it's a cool song. I feel like you should just call it a cool song. It, ain't enough, bro. Yeah, it's not. I mean, oh, it's, it's a cool song. Damn, I ain't gonna lie. You just said something, Gerald. Yeah, <laughs> bro. This is talking about that, that is a every trap. song. Damn. It's Classic. a cool. It is. It's a cool song. He was talking about it on damn near every song, though. I get it. Wait. So what? Get your twelve. So wait. Right, so now let me ask you a question. So. Because he was one of the first, and he talking about whatever he talking about. You, know, it's not other music that is better. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, he made it a hot song. I'm not getting in the car putting on Mr. Big. Shit, I am. Shit. Yeah, I got that. Boy I still I'm mad. It's I'm sorry. Hard. I was on I know that's my heart. I'm trying to warn you. you. Give me some sort of fucking beat drop. Yeah, yeah, that bit like I'm just like that. Like, ain't none of that shit trap it down. I'm sorry. I feel you. Cause it's a whole album, <laughs> but Trap It Down like Wiz nah, Khalifa. Give a fuck. Uh, what, pick a song. What, what, pick a song Khalifa, on Trap It Down. Uh, right, Cushion OJ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pick a song on Trap It Down. Trap It Down is the trap Cushion OJ, bro. Like <laughs> we 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 see that ass. Oh, it just came out. Like nah, bro. That shit had drama. That shit had some high end productions. Yeah, them boys was getting real money. Just like Cushion Orange was like, yeah, it's a mixtape, but mm -hmm. it's mixing master. Yeah, like you feel me? It, it wasn't the mixtape we was putting out. Man, that was a different league. So of course that thing like perfect. Yeah, but it's yeah. Go ahead. Nah, I was saying, uh, shit. You want to end it? Cause yeah, yeah, for sure. I know these cameras about to die soon. <laughs> so yeah, man. Before we get in on these topics, cause we'll be in this bitch talking for three hours. Right. So yeah, make sure y'all like, subscribe, follow the Instagram, Flystone the three hundred five. Shit, if y'all want to say your Instagram name, y'all go G ahead. Chef G Money sixty four. Yeah, man, way more fly than you. T. Hey, my uh, name's T. Uptown T. <laughs> Iguanda T. <laughs> <laughs> ah, man. But no, uh, Dan, Dan Son of Man. Dan girl, underscore girl. Son of Man all together. <laughs> all sure. platforms. Yeah, you. Man. We'll holler at y'all next week. Yo. We out.